John, it's the, the first league game of the new season away to Dumbarton. Um, looking forward to it and how's the preparation been so far? Yeah, of course we're looking forward to it. Yeah, I mean, this is uh, the be all and end all. This is the bread and butter. You know, it's the first game of 36 league games, uh, a marathon, you know. So, uh, we want to get out of the blocks, obviously. Every team does, you know. It's, a, it's the start of the season, the real, the real stuff that's, uh, you know, what we're all here for is to try and get into the, the championship come, you know, uh, May next year. And this is the first step in it. And of course, every team starting out on Saturday wants a good start, you know, and we're certainly looking for a good start. Uh, we did okay last season in Dumbarton, the way to Dumbarton, uh, they'll know that as well. Uh, so we are, we're looking very positively, uh, you know, we're looking for a response from last Saturday as well, uh, which hopefully is a good thing. Now we're looking for a response and we're looking to go out and put one or two things right. So that can be a positive in regards to exactly that. You know, it can be added, uh, an added edge to the thing that we're looking to bounce back from last week and show we're better than we are. We were last week. We are better than we, we you know, we were last week. So we're looking to to uh, to make amends and we're obviously looking there to go there and uh, play well. Hopefully play well enough to win the football match and get a good start. Like ourselves, Dumbarton have made changes from last season. You know, we can't base everything on what has happened in the past there, but there'll be no pushovers. No, there's no easy games in this league, is there? Well, at the start of the season, everyone's starting from a clean slate. You know, no one's got any points on the board. There's no one left adrift at the bottom of the table or anything like that. You know, we're all in the mix. So everyone's there. Everyone is ready to get started. And uh, no matter what's happened in the Betfred Cup, the league, you know, cup groups. It's a fresh start, you know, it's, uh, that's over and done with. And every team going out there, you know, it's, uh, it's a different ball game. It's, it's league, it's league business. And everyone's starting for, as I say, zero points. And uh, everything at this moment in time potentially is, uh, you know, looking, looking forward. Everyone, every single team should be looking to win the game to, to start positively and, and win the league. And of course, I think that's, what, that's got to be your mentality and it's got to be our mentality. The players, um, they had food for thought after last weekend. How's their preparation and attitude and performance been in training so far? Like, I mean, look, we had a bad day at office, you know, that will happen from time to time. It was unexpected. I didn't really think that we could play as badly as that. And I'm, uh, I'm hoping it's a one-off or I'm hoping it's, you know, there are very few uh, in, in the season coming like that, you know. Uh, so, it, you know, unfortunately, you know, it happens, you know. I was hoping it doesn't happen too often. No, we've... We came back in. Obviously, you go over the the, the analysis and you dissect things, and you, and then you move on. And that's exactly what we've done. We've got to move on. We need to be positive. You know, this is what it's all about. This is a this is the league campaign, and this this is where everything we want to start hit the ground running and uh, build momentum and go from one week to the next week, looking to build on it. In terms of the composition of the of your starting eleven this weekend, obviously Dave McGann came back in at goals. Uh, Mikey Miller missed out. Is there any other? Um, Injury news or changes that you can talk about at this point? Yeah, well, we know that both Ian Davison and Brad came off uh, with injuries as well during the game. So uh, we're anticipating them training, uh, you know, today. You know, we're still got to uh, uh, completely confirm that. But we're, we're looking for them to train today with a few training Friday also and being available for selection. Mike is back from the way in America. And so, you know, we're looking to have as full of strength squad as we can possibly have with the exception of the three longer term uh, injuries that we have. Yeah. And, and final question, you will also, after Saturday, you won't be looking beyond it, but you'll be looking forward to the, the next game after that, which is our first home league fixture against Clyde in front of the Star Sparks fans. Yeah, we, we can only take one game at a time. We've, yeah. we've got to look at Dumbarton, we've got to get a, try and get a start at Dumbarton, we've got to put every amount of energy and uh, you know professionalism and ability into the Dumbarton game. I think we've got to go and look after ourselves. There's no point looking to another game and to another team and all that kind of stuff. We've just got to look at going to Dumbarton Saturday between 3 o'clock and 5 o'clock, playing the best we possibly can to get a result. Great. Well, thanks for that. Good luck, John. Thank you.